I'm Laura from Hair Hardware and today I'm going to show you how to make this really cute ladybug ribbon sculpture clippy. The materials that you're going to need for this little clip are a single prong alligator clip. You're going to need four and a half inches of black grosgrain ribbon and then for this since it's a ladybug I'm using red and black dot ribbon and you're going to need three pieces to make the body. The first piece is two inches long the second piece is three inches long and the third piece is four inches long and you're going to want to make sure that when you cut it that you use something like a wood burner to seal the edges so that they don't fray and you're also going to need a little bit of black grosgrain ribbon this piece is cut to about one and a quarter inches long and this piece right here we're going to use for the antenna and it's about three quarters of an inch three quarters of an inch long. So what we're going to do first is we're going to use these three red and black dot pieces to make the body. And the body is made in three parts. So I'm going to start with the smallest piece and what you're going to do is you're going to bring the ends together and you're going to glue them so that they're perpendicular where you make it like a right angle and it's going to make a loop like this. So you're just going to put a little bit of glue on one end and then you're going to bring the other side around and glue it like that. And then you can set it aside and you're going to do the same thing for all three pieces. The first piece, the small piece, if you start with that, it's a little more difficult than the other pieces just because you're working with a smaller piece of ribbon. Make sure that you put the glue on the printed side and glue it together like that. Otherwise, your print will be on the inside and you won't be able to see it for the ladybug. So now to put the body together, you're going to take your big piece and you're going to put a little bit of, you're going to flip it over and you're going to put a little bit of glue on the inside at the point. And then you're going to take the medium piece and glue it right on top of that. Just place the ends together like that. And then you're going to take your third piece and you're going to do the same thing. The little piece is going to go like that. And now you have your body done. It's a little bit of glue strings there. And you're going to want to make the antenna next. Now the antenna are a little tricky to do because you have to cut and seal small pieces of ribbon. And with grosgrain ribbon on the edges, there is um, a little bit of edge. It's called a monofilament edge. And there is a little piece of some type of fiber that runs through giving it support on the side of the ribbon and that's what we're going to use for the antenna. So you're going to take your scissors, I've already done one side and I've cut very close to that edge and I cut about half an inch down. If you can see that there, I'll try to make it so you can see it. This piece right here at the end. And now I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to very carefully cut the other side for the antenna. So now it's like this. And that's what you're going to use for the antenna. But you're going to need to cut this middle piece out like this. And when you do that, you have to seal this little edge that you cut for the antenna. So you're going to take a wood burner and you're just going to very carefully run it across the cut edge. Just the inside of it. You don't have to seal the outside because that's already sealed from the way that the ribbon is made. So now you're going to, this is your antenna, and you're going to glue it to the front like this. So you're going to put just a little bit of glue right at the front of your ladybug body piece and you're going to glue the antenna right on like that. Okay. So you're going to want to cover that. So that's where you need this piece of black grosgrain ribbon that's one and a quarter inches long. 
So when you glue it on, you're going to put it on, you're going to center it like that, and then you're just going to fold it around like this. And that way just the antenna will stick out and be like the ladybug's head. So just put a little bit of glue right on top of where you just put the antenna. Center that piece like this. And it's going to be sticking out on the sides. So you're going to flip it over. You're going to put some more glue on the inside. And then just fold your black grill green ribbon over like this so that it gives you your little ladybug piece. Now you have to line the alligator clip to attach it to. And I'm just lining mine on a single prong alligator clip. So what you do, you need four and a half inches of ribbon and I'm using black grain. You're going to put a strip of glue about an inch and a half long, open your alligator clip and then place it right inside like that. And then you can also just press it, make sure it's nice and secure. Then you're going to put a strip of glue on top of the alligator clip, take the ribbon, bring it around, press it on there, make sure that it's straight and that it is adhered to the glue. And then you're going to put some glue on the rest of the ribbon and then press it inside the hinge a little bit and then that piece that's remaining, just press it on the back of the bottom of the alligator clip. Now to attach your ladybug to your lined alligator clip, you're going to want to put some glue right underneath the head of the ladybug. So you're going to put some glue here and you're going to just press it down on your alligator clip like this. And now you have your ladybug attached to your lined alligator clip. It's a real fun and simple project. It looks really cute even with other colors. You can play around with the colors. You don't have to use black and red, but I did just for these samples. And you can have fun with it.